Sorry. So this is the last layer with the dyes that are going to be in this. And like I said, because the manufacturer only allows or only suggests that you put a quarter inch per pour, let's just take advantage of that situation and go ahead and add different layers because you'll see, I hope that the video shows that you're creating a depth with inside of this clear epoxy with the dyes running through it in this fashion instead of just mixing it all in to make it continuous. So I think that's a little bit more dramatic. And then when, you, when we pull this apart, you get to see the side, you get to see in, and you will get to see that depth inside of there. So until next time, I'm Mr. C in the shop. And if you'd like to go ahead and enter to win this, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and put a comment in. If you don't want to, I understand that. If you even want to put a dislike or why you don't like it, I'm all for it. Go for it, and I'll still give you an entry. Or you can just decide to just lay back and go, I liked watching it, or I didn't like watching it, but not saying a word. Either way, anyway, it work, works for me. And uh, we'll see you next time, and we're going to put the clear coat on that, and then after that, we'll start discussing exactly what kind of structure system we're going to use to hold this up to show off our beautiful work with the epoxy resin. So until next time, I'm Mr. C. We'll see you. Have a great evening. Bye.